Good morning. It is Saturday morning and it is decorating day. It's the Saturday before Thanksgiving and I'm so excited to decorate for Christmas. And since I've moved, I can't remember what I have or what I bought. So let's go see what's in the closet. just went floating across. I could live in New York. Right in front of me. <gasps> I had a little orb. Or maybe it was dust. I don't know what it was. It was kind of weird though. Alright, so we are going to start in the hallway, which uh, needs lots of work. Let's turn on the light and see what we've got in the store closet which I absolutely love the store closet because um, if you remember my very first video of the tour, um, we, we went all through the, I, I'm losing a cat. Hey, Dory, Pandora, get out of there. All right, so I'm gonna start pulling stuff out and um, we'll see what we've got for so Christmas. After we pulled everything out of the closet, except the Christmas trees, there it goes, uh, I've got, all of this stuff here, I've got this bin, the stuff on the stairs that I'm making stuff out of, and these three bins, and again, this is just uh, what I had mostly from last year, some decorating stuff, and um, yeah, we still have a whole lot more to make. Um, I'm going to start with the dining room table and first I had to defall it and I'm going to clean it off from our taste testing uh, catastrophe a few days ago. So let's start with a good clean. for a break. I'm telling you, I am worn out already and my house is a disaster, but I have to take a break because it is time to put the ribs on for supper. Mm. It's going to be a good night. Um, give me just a few minutes and then we'll be back to decorating. Excuse the very dusty floor. I've been sanding and sanding, uh, still working on the stairs, but we have to take all of the fall stuff down and kind of rearrange. So this is our next project. For right now, the teapots are going to find another home and bye-bye to the pumpkins, even though it is 
not quite Thanksgiving yet, um, we're changing the mood. And I feel like, <laughs> I feel like we all really need this early. I think all of the people I know are decorating even earlier this year because, um, yeah, I love this. By the way, I thrifted this a few weeks ago. Um, I'm not really sure. Okay, $4.99. That's what I paid for it. I don't really know. I'm guessing 1970s. I'm not sure, but I absolutely love it. It will probably come out again in the spring because even though it's yellow, it can kind of go fall. Spring, summer, fall, and I love that. Um, here's another thing that will stay. This will probably, I don't know. It might stay, it might go. We'll see. going through my stuff I came across this little jar that I literally have had for years in fact my mom actually kept it for a while I made this little jar <laughs> my crafting skills weren't great but it is called what Christmas is made of I had typed out questions um okay what is your best memory of Santa Claus and so what happens is you go around the room and um, with your guests or your kids or whatever, you answer the question and it's a great conversation starter. So it's not the prettiest thing, but I am, I super love it. So what I've done here is I took and I put my extra mat that I said I, I had and I've added some very inexpensive greenery. This was actually a very long piece that I stuffed in the tree last year, um, but I added a paper mache angel. And these right here are the coolest things. This is actually from a um, magnolia tree. And I painted this, oh my gosh, it's probably been about seven years ago. And I painted them silver. I actually painted several of them uh, different colors. That's what I used. That's when I started using all this um, learning to decorate from outside. It was not just because I like it. Now I just like it, but it was actually necessity. For right now, I think this looks about as cottage as you can get. And I, I love this too. Okay, well, I have to stop here and I can't show you the whole thing because I've got some crafting to do and if I show you, it's gonna give away the final product. So catch me in my next video. Um, so far, I haven't had a ghost show up in my crafting video, but it, it, it could happen. Um, it seemed to just be at the old part of the house when we were like, you know, sneaking around in there. So maybe that's what it was. Anyway, um, like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. And as always, here is the cut reel. Yes, the light is terrible. I'm freezing. It's really cold in here. Oh, really cold. What happened to my sunshine? Sound. I need some sound. I need some sound.